an epitome of adventure by itself because it's a mixed breed of nature and simplicity. Well, this is about trading and right here I'm at the Wokies farm man. The amazing things that here are going to blow your mind. So stay with me, let me show you around man. This place is breathtaking. Normally when you're on the road, you just see only the, you know, <laughs> the fence and thing, man. But in here, it's a paradise, you know. This is a paradise, guys. Look at the pool. See how... Here we are like an ecotourism base. We have animals. Okay. Donut of all kinds and all species. We have few animals. Okay. We have guest houses here. We have a bar and restaurant. We have our pool. And we have our, of course, which is going to be the biggest in Liberia, okay. 18 holes, and we are working on opening it soon. Okay. So for some of the animals we have here, we have horses, oh. we got camel, we got donkeys. Mm -hmm. Guys, watch the video to the end. I'm going to be showing you every animal and everything she's talking about. We got bull, we got the royal bird, which is the pickup, we got ostrich, we got a cow barn, we got a pig grade. And all these things are available where schools and other university students come to the tourism and know more about this animal, how they feed, how they go along reproduction, and many more. And then one of our biggest uh, entertainment spot here is the bar and restaurant, which we are sitting in now, and the pool, which is outside, is our biggest entertainment. Okay. And we got chalet rooms. I think you were there, you saw the chalet room. Yeah. I don't know if you have if you chance or have gotten a view of it. Yeah, this is the Vida. You do the Vida, right? Well, this is a board trader, and today I'm right here on the Wokies Farm, and I'm with the manager of the business. So, I want you guys to just listen to her, and I mean, listen to the good things that she has to offer on this farm. So, how are you doing, madam? I'm fine, you? I'm amazing. Uh, what's the name, please? Tell the people your name. Yeah. I'm Shagley Pierre Williams. Okay. And I'm the accounts and business manager, not general manager. Ah, okay. That's almost the same, but tell me, what what would you say to people out there about Walking Farm? Um, well, I can call Walking Farm an adventure, an epitome of adventure by itself, because it's a mixed breed of nature and simplicity so my visit to the richest man in liberia compound gives me a sense of sense of development and i mean nature it just makes me feel so good and this man is so humble to the level where everything he he won in a place like everything he would need to live in his compound is there he got a bar he got a pool he got a restaurant he got he got a, a he, he in, in fact he grew everything he wants to eat everything he eats he grows it he got so and the, the amazing thing is he opened this place to the public so that you can swim in the pool that he can swim in so that you can eat what he's eating and that you can ride the donkey that he's riding isn't that amazing guys so anyways i just want you guys to see everything on this compound i i mean I, this video i try as much as possible to cut a shot so but i want you to see right the things that are here the beauty that's here i just want you to see every single thing man it is so 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 amazing so beautiful so just stay tuned just hold on be patient and then we're gonna go through everything I, I like i always tell you guys in my video i save the best for the last right so just wait in the last you're gonna see all of the beautiful animals out of the i mean the horse the usher the quail the the donkey the i mean every single thing you're gonna see it every every beautiful thing is in the end of it's in the end of the video so stay tuned relax yourself and let's enjoy this epitome of adventure together just as i told you right 
Liberia told the world, guys, if you are not in Liberia or have not come to Liberia, you need to come and visit. The things I'm saying, the reason why we tourists or we that produce content on tourism go out there and showcase what we're doing is because we want you to see these things with your eyes to see how beautiful the things that we are seeing are to see how nice they look man this is this is god giving uh, our, our, our nature man see the beauty of liberia i mean it's so so beautiful honestly speaking i feel very motivated right now to be rich honestly speaking like every time i go out and do a video on tourism I, I, I feel so blessed i feel that god has created a lot of great things that we need to endure you know that we need to see and that we need to invest our money into so i mean there should be something that should motivate our well-being that should, that should motivate our our nature something that should motivate us to do more better than what our fellow man is doing you know to achieve more to there should be something man right now i'm triggered i'm triggered to 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 even get more money than the richest man in liberia been in that year and to even build more and to get i mean to get to the point where i have everything i want at my disclosure man so like you see here man this place is beautiful it's about time i take you into the compound the house the home of the richest man in liberia so guys hold on fasten your seatbelt and let's move to this mansion like from the outside and the inside you will know that this is a mansion guy so just hold on i'm going to show you this beautiful edifice I mean, just look at it. This building was built when, you know, when Liberia did not have even technology. And this man is investing all of his resources into information technology. He's a businessman. That's just one of his businesses, man. Look at this beautiful statue. Look at how beautiful this lady is. And look at this building. Look at the architecture design, man. Wow. This is beautiful, man. This is amazing look at that see that beautiful building man guys it will astonish you to know that this building <laughs> is so expensive and you see those two archers right the black one is always the male and the gray looking one or the ash looking one is always the female and they look at the i mean these birds are taller than me i was so afraid to go to it like they are huge so i mean everything look at it look at this this turkey whole day we're eating turkey someone all can eat turkey we don't even know what turkey look like <laughs> look, look look at this man see how huge this these birds are they're taller than me they they, they are faster than me in running look at this other beautiful bird some of the animals i'm going to show you i haven't seen them before don't even know them man and this like this this is this is the richest man in liberia car collection i just want you to see them everything is in black everything is i mean everything is classic you know black is classic man and see see the cars man guys this is amazing man it's so so beautiful so beautiful and the guy was telling me like oh there's a snake in that box i'm like no i'm not going to <laughs> go to see no snake <laughs> in a box and he was like oh this ah wow guys look at this beautiful beautiful green forest you just sit in the forest you chat with your friends you just have a quiet time a quiet quiet time man and the beautiful thing about this place or this park is that it can the all the trees has different artwork that you can see african culture african history from man just just look at these trees 
Pretty man, man, this is beautiful, man. This is so, 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 so seductive, so beautiful, so amazing. Wow, man, I, I want to just say that I enjoy every, every moment I spend in this place, man. I enjoy every, everything I've ever seen here. I enjoy looking at it. I can come here a hundred times more, man. This place has a spot in my heart this is beautiful man so so beautiful wow wow look at this look at this look at this carving man like man when you get money in you hey, this is the crocodile pit who's going to go there no i told them like there are certain things right i want to see but i rather see them off camera than physically you know <laughs> because I'm not going to go to Crocodile. <laughs> what if that nigga get angry one day? <laughs> Guys, man, this place. So look at the quail, right? Look at them. Look at them, man. Look at this. Man, this is beautiful. It's so beautiful. And guys, this is the time that I take you to the villa. But that's how they call it in here, man. And look at the lepos. These are the lepos you're looking at. Like, look so beautiful and look like something different. <laughs> Guys, don't get me wrong, man. P gray, yes, I can go to the P gray. Yes, and uh, I can go to the ch chocolates. It's called chocolates, right? Okay. Wow, this is amazing. So, so beautiful. I want you to see, man, this is sweet. Guys, Liberians, come on, man. One person can own this, we can own this, you can own this, man. This is, man, I'm so jealous right now. Like, I want to own, I want to own more than 100 portion of this and better, man. Like, I mean, it's beautiful here. Like everything is green everything is beautiful the, like whoever that put this farm together this is a farm right and whoever that put it together and called it a farm that person is a genius man you like you got everything on the farm everything you need this is not our our normal farm that we know right this is like everything and i'm gonna take you to the like the real agricultural farm <laughs> but here this one now is all about you know tourism site it's all about you know recreational places and things you know a zoo everything you're looking at right now so be patient you're gonna see all the other animals later i tell you guys you gotta go through this video to the very end the best is at the last. Look at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Palawa hearts. And see, man, guys, look at this. Guys, keep liking and sharing this video. You have to be liking and sharing right now. You have to follow. You have to, like, just keep going. If you reach at this point, it should tell you that you have watched something amazing, man something beautiful so you should like this video follow and share man look at this man this is amazing this look at this classic keyboard very classic very beautiful it's just there for customer you come you sit on the keyboard and you start playing sweet melody song man sweet music and see the restaurant up here what would you prefer I would prefer spending one night here because trust me, our place is fully AC. We got hot and cold shower. Our rooms come with the privileges of using the pool. It comes with breakfast and we have electricity. So, I mean, a white chase after. Guys, I mean, this video, right? I think I should have cut this video into part one, two, three, and four. But this is, this is so, 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 so beautiful. Like look, look in the uh, uh, chocolate or the vida. 
see the room side here see how clean they are see how nice the bed is i mean imagine you on a farm and this is here you you sleeping on the farm right and you 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 just when you wake up in the morning you wake up to this you wake up to seeing these beautiful trees green quiet environment man this is this is something like i'm like wow look at this man look at this man look look, look. oh my god africa is so beautiful liberia is so so beautiful guys we need to think liberia love liberia build liberia look in here man the good thing is that immediately you come here you, you feel nature you feel the blessing of course of course so it's time for you to go and see the Duncan, the house. I mean, it's time to see the beautiful animals, right? So right here is the different, different room. They have the slaughterhouse there. But everything here is, is so, and the environment is so clean, so serene. You don't see any dirt. Adventure. Everything. Where, where are they? They are in Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay. There. Wow. Okay. Okay. Guys, you see this? It's very, it's very deep. That's right, we are getting right there. You see that statue of the donkey? It means that it's about time you see a living donkey. <laughs> a donkey in a house. So, this is the time that I show you guys even a camel <laughs> a living camel and guess what some of the dunking some of the houses rather are taller than me look at this one it's taller than me it's bigger than me <laughs> and <laughs> this is a dunking the first one you saw was a house this is a dunking you see the dunking are the smaller ones all right, and this is a camel. This is a camel. Damn, you know how much for anything in Dubai or Egypt? This is man. Look at this, and the the guy is so tall. Like he's tall. And I mean, see the houses, but I I, I won't go closer to them. That's the thing, right? Look at this, man. Mm -hmm. Look at how beautiful this mm -hmm. thing is. Look at how, look at how beautiful this thing is, man! Wow, and they are playing love. <laughs> the the camel is playing love with the donkey. The story I heard was that the camel were two on the farm. There was a male and a female, but the female died, so the male is still here, and he's just lonely. So he just have to make the houses mm -hmm. his friend, you know. Wow, guys, this is beautiful, man. This is beautiful. This is a donkey. This the, let me just show you guys the difference. This is a donkey right here, small, and this is a house. So, and that's the species, right? They look they, they look the same, but this one, whenever you see it small like this, it's a donkey. When it's huge like this, it's a house. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you following me to the end. But I just want you to know that the other animals, I'm going to show you in the other video. Thank you.